Hello everyone, welcome to CFC Fan TV. Charlie here. I'm standing outside Turf Moor where Chelsea have just taken Burnley to the cleaners. What a great performance. I think it's one of the best performances of all season. Um, I've, been, I've been worried, I know a lot of other people have, that we haven't got enough goals in the team, especially without Eden Hazard playing and that we're no good without Eden Hazard. Eden Hazard wasn't playing today. Chelsea won 4-0 and there were four different goal scorers. And, and suddenly, you know, when we play like that, it's looking like we do have goals in the team. I think the influx of Barkley in particular has added a hell of a lot of kind of impetus attacking wise and it's added a lot of goal threat in the final third. Um, Loftus Cheek, it was great to see him come on after, you know, I think a lot of people are such a great midweek for him, you know, a hat trick and the first, first hat trick by a homegrown Chelsea player since Clive Walker, that's a stat for you. Um, that you know he wasn't going to get any minutes. Obviously, it took an injury for Pedro to get him some, but he was fantastic when he came on. He was making those driving runs we know he can do, and I think, you know, I think that that wide position could be could be the way forward for him. I know a lot of people are saying he should play should play centre forward, but I think I think in that position, if if he can make himself an option in that position, it's going to stand him in really good stead. Um, because the midfield is congested, and you know you do have to be that much more disciplined. Um, but I, th I think his driving runs from wide can be can be a real asset. They certainly were today, and he he was um, he was re rewarded with the uh, with the last goal. Um, I want to say something about Alvaro Morata as well. I thought he was really really good today. Um, he's had a lot of criticism, you know, quite quite justly in my opinion. But he's he did everything you could want a centre forward to do today. He was making a lot more runs, making himself a lot more available. He had you know he had quite a few chances, but but you know he he scored, and that's. That's kind of all you can. That's all you can take away from this game, and I think, you know, he's he's not on the floor moaning so much. He looked he looked livid to be taken off, and he went straight down the tunnel, which is kind of uh, where his mindset is right now, maybe. But um, uh, you know, I've, I'm a big fan of Olivier Giroud, and he was desperate to score when he came. Out. I was desperate for him to score, but you know, he he's he's really not in the goals at the minute, and I think while. I'm not convinced Morata is the long-term solution. I do think that, you know, for the time being, um, you know, he, he, he is he's starting to find the net a bit more, which is, which is great for Chelsea and obviously great for him. Um, Willian, obviously the other scorer, I think um, he, he, he deserved a goal. I mean, he, was, he hit the post twice. He, 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 was, he was running for the team. And, you know, I think just, just the whole general play was, was so good today. I mean, there was a... There was a period in the second half when you know Chelsea fans giving it oi 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 for for each pass, and I I, I got knackered. I, was, I did it about fifty times in a row. Um, but it's you know without Eden Hazard, at a tough place to come, and you know I, the crowd were brilliant today. I think they were really getting behind the players, and I think you can see that you know there's um, there's some real affection starting to be shown towards Sarri and and the way we're playing and kind of this setup, and we move move further ahead of Arsenal. Um, which which is great. Obviously, they, they uh, I, I saw they were losing half time and, the, and then they were winning during the second half. Uh, Palace got a last minute equaliser, so happy days. And uh, and yeah, I just I'm just ecstatic. It's a long, long way to come, and uh, you know to be rewarded with a performance like that is uh, is, is is great news. So anyway, um, let me know what you thought of the game. Um, you know, let me know who your man of the match was. Um, and uh, yeah, I'll be in the comments later. Make sure you subscribe. And yeah, come on, Chelsea.